Oh, this is gonna be hard. It's gonna suck a bit harder, but. Or not. <laughs> what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another vlog. I'm starting a vlog off today with my friend Josue. Why? Because we are going to be installing his oil catch can. But the whole drilling part is not my idea, it was this guy's idea. So don't be fucking going over there talking shit about me saying that, oh yeah, this who drilled his, his firewall. This is this guy's idea. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see the bad. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so this is gonna happen. So this is a quick the oil catch can. We're gonna drill a hole somewhere here. Hopefully we can get it through with the drill bit. Um, use two screws, one on each hole, and then grab it through the inside. He doesn't have an inner fender, so we can reach our hand in here and try to get the screw tightened through there. So it's probably gonna sit like that, and then the hose is gonna run all the way around here. CV right here and then it's right there and it should be pretty good. So this little bracket goes onto the catch can. So it's gonna be something like that. Man, this is gonna be hard, it's gonna suck a bit harder. Or not. There's your holes, man. Just <laughs> do not, do not do this. I'm not encouraging any of you to do this. This is not my idea, like I said. This is the, the main man. This is his car. I'm only following his rules. This is what he wants to do. I gotta do what he wants. You know? So, this is gonna go through here bracket and then through the inside we're gonna grab the line long screw and then just tighten it up and then everything should be good hella modifications all that for oh catch can yeah. where it should have i mean the original spot it should have gone should have been right here by the power steering cool the power steering fluid reservoir and the freaking coolant reservoir but I guess they sent me the wrong bracket and it was for a 350Z. I ordered one for the G35, but gave me the one for the 350. I had no other choice but to do it through my firewall. All right, guys, quick update. We got it. We got it. We got it. Ain't an ass. We got it. Ain't an ass. We fucking got it. I don't know if you guys can tell it. You see those? little metal things right there just shining so we finally got it it's on there man i was giving up a i was giving up my forearm for this was fucking oil catch can but it's not going nowhere all right just a quick tip for those of you that don't know there's an inlet and then there's an outlet your inlet it's going into your engine, which is right here where your PCV valve is. Let me get my phone so you guys can see it. Where are you my phone at? Oh, he's losing his thing. So your inlet is going right here to your PCV. And then your outlet is going to go right here to your blender. Just a, a little tip to you guys. It's tight. Yeah, you're good. <laughs> nice and sturdy. So guys, when you're going to take this off, be extremely careful because that PCV valve is very, very sensitive. Yup. And you will break it. 
if you are not careful. And I don't know where you would find that part. Probably a dealership. And you guys already know that's not gonna be pretty price. This is a little peepee -pee thing that's all sweat size. And then this is my longer one. <laughs> but for real guys, be careful with that piece because that is very sensitive and if you break it you are screwed. Outlet, yeah. Right? Yeah, outlet. This outlet, outlet goes to the is intake. going to your intake. So that one's gonna go in here. Right. Yeah. But right. first, before I forget and I fuck up. This shit. Out to here. Oh! Oh man, that's gonna be a tight It's so tight. It's us. So tight. Oh, you like that, baby? It's a so, <laughs> it's a so tight. <laughs> well, that's all they needed. Tip. It just, it tip. Just, it just needed some. Tip number one. Oh my God, bro. Tip. Some nice lube. Just, just, just lube it up. Nice lube. Just lube it up. Just sure lube it up. get a little bit of oil. It's oil, so don't lube up, lube up the hose, and lube up this whatever shit from the intake is called just loop it up and it'll slide right in where's your uh, lesson learned right we were we were literally struggling to put that shit on all, all you needed to do was just loop it up that's it yeah, yeah we literally and you know what this guy why don't we just put some oil on it and i forgot that oil runs through that so <laughs> <laughs> covers all these hoses so it'll be all good but other than that we're good we are good should i show them the i haven't shown the tail lights should, yeah. should i show them the tail lights now that it's dark or should i wait i'll leave it up to this guy that's it right now right now Right. So, for those of you that don't follow me on Instagram, you guys have no idea what, what I'm talking about. But, just a quick update, I don't have the same you know, my stock. I mean, they are the stock tail lights, so it's just a different modification that, that we're done to them. So, I'll show you guys right now. Hopefully, you guys can see it. Oh, yes. Is that a GTR, dog? <laughs> I wish it was a GTR. It's a poor man's GTR. Tip on the brake. Yeah. So yes, they got custom halos, and then when you step on them, they get brighter. I think they look badass. I love them. It's just a, a poor man's GTR because I can't afford one right now. Yeah. Those are, those are the tail lights, man. The modern tail lights. If you guys are not following me on Instagram, you 
you guys should go follow me. I'll leave my IG somewhere, somewhere in the screen. I do daily posts, pictures of my car. If you guys are interested, you guys can keep updated. And then, if you guys wanna follow this guy, make pretty clean IG. Follow him. I'll put his Instagram somewhere in the screen. But yeah, guys, that's gonna be it. I'm about to go home. It's what time is it? It is 1.20 in the morning. 1.20 in the morning. We started this at what? Like 11? Like 11.30. Like 11.30. We ran into some issues like always. This was supposed to be like yeah. probably... The easiest thing. I want to say like a... What? 20 minute install? The easiest things are always the most hardest. You always and run into something. Man. It's always an issue. Like it's always the simplest things that you, you run into an issue and it just takes you forever. But we're finally done. 1.20 in the morning. See you guys in the next one. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, what are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? Hit that subscribe button. I'm going to do a 100 subscriber giveaway. This guy doesn't even know about it yet. I know what I'm going to do. You guys don't. So let's get to 100 and then you guys will find out. I'm going to win. I know that. <laughs> no, I don't know. I, I'm not I'm not like that. I'll see you guys on the next one. I'm going to be doing a clutch line install on my car. So you guys will be seeing that. So I'll catch you guys in the next video, guys.